Hi, uh, this is a new update uh, about my RK 3D printer. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll start first with the things I have installed so far. The board is uh, MKS S base, uh, 32 bits. I installed also the smart steppers. These drivers, they are drivers with encoder. Uh, uh, they are awesome actually. I, I like them very much because uh, because I can, for example, that's if I do like this, it will just continue. Uh, right now I'm printing uh, another extruder carriage because I am removing the nimbles, the nimble extruders because uh, it turns out uh, they don't uh, they don't work as expected because of this flexible shaft um, that any tiny movement like if you print uh, very low layer height or very slowly then this flexible shaft uh, doesn't uh, translate the movement uh, immediately from here to here so instead of moving directly here uh, it's compressed it's like spring then the filament moves by steps by by very big steps down uh, instead of being very smooth because it, it has a 1 to 30 uh, gear ratio so it should be super smooth but it's not uh, like that at all uh, the the company uh, the team of the company suggested using uh, uh, loop 10k loop uh, but I'm not convinced with that because you know it shouldn't be like uh, even if if we are not using uh, any loop at all it should just work because the the, the force should be really strong at uh, 1 to 13 ra uh, gear ratio so now I'm printing another uh, extruder mount and I will use uh, button setup with T10, uh, T10 uh, extruders, I will put them here in the back. Uh, I think that's it for now. Uh, I'm still uh, waiting uh, for the 550 millimeters, uh, eight, eight uh, millimeter uh, road to use the the new. Uh, Z system I designed it will not use the threaded roads it will be using belts instead here so it will have zero wobble uh, for the Z and also it's cheaper and much higher quality because I will use this motor here I will use uh, 1 to 20 worm gear a uh, 1 to 20 ratio so it's a uh, very high resolution also the bed doesn't drop down uh, because of the worm gear that I will be using uh, it's, uh, you can see it in the design uh, the design is online uh, so it's, it's all for free available and uh, the CAD uh, the CAD and the STL you can download the, the one you like that's it for now just final look at the smart stepper it can go from uh, one, uh, 116 to uh, 120 uh, 256 uh, steps so uh, it can go very high in steps but uh, I'm using it with the default settings uh, one on uh, 16 and it's uh, actually quite nice it reduces the noise very much 
if something happened during a print uh, like uh, the plastic just the, the extruder hit the plastic then it will go back to the to the uh, uh, position it should be hmm. like that it's very hard I'm, I'm not uh, I'm not able to move it okay so see you in another video when I install the Z system and the two uh, T10 extruders with bonus setup. Bye bye.